Hi, my name is Cece Hall, Application Analyst here at Lycor Biosciences. Today I'm going to take you through how to set up your instrument for high throughput measurements. And a very nice feature of the LI600 parameter fluorometer is that it has a barcode scanner here at the bottom side. It's a small window. Uh, and you can use the, this one to scan uh, regular barcodes or QR codes. If you have multiple plots where each plot has an associated treatment and replicate, you can set this up in a combined um, barcode and then you can use the 600 to go around and you know you make it you read that barcode and then you make measurements on it within that uh, within that plot and you can find uh, you can get there's free uh, barcode generators online which you can use and we found it easiest when you print these out if you put them um, a single barcode per sheet and then if you have multiple sheets because then you won't read the wrong barcode so that's a nice example uh, so now we're going to go through, we're first going to start with setting up our configuration and then we're going to load it to the instrument and make a few measurements. Okay, so we'll start by turning our instrument on. Then we will go to the Explore LI600. Then we'll select the Configuration Management. and we will create a new configuration. I'm going to name this one test as well. And then the author name, I will give it my name, CC, and I will include the parameter options. We'll go down here to data labels where we are gonna select a new data label. The first one here is, or we're going to select a barcode and we need to give it a name. I'm going to give it treatment. And then we'll go down to auto mode. Yes, I do want auto mode, conductance and fluorescence. And I want to set them to fast. We'll go down to remarks. I'll add a remark just in case. Measurement settings. I want to do MPFs. We'll go down to display layout. This looks fine, as long as I have my conductance and my, I might want to add my fluorescence. We'll add something here for PS2. And then we will go to the preview. This all looks good. I have my data label. I have my treatment set up for my barcode. Ready to save configuration. And then upload this configuration to my instruments. Upload. Okay, so now we are ready to take our instruments and go and make our measurements. Okay, so now we're ready to make our uh, high throughput measurements. So we're gonna go down and select a new configuration that we just created named test. So push enter and it's gonna match. So once it's done matching, um, I'm moving to onto my first leaf and I want to use the barcode scanner for this that I just set up. So we'll go here to treatment. We'll scan our barcode. Done. We're ready to clamp onto a leaf. It's looking for stability. Okay, we'll unclamp, go back, select a new leaf. And we still, we're still within that same treatment, so we're just going to clamp onto that next leaf. We don't have to uh, scan the barcode again. It's going to look for stability. Make a measurement, unclamp. We'll do that one more time. Clamp onto a leaf. And then we're done. So now we've gone through these rapid measurements and if at any time you want to change that barcode, you can always access it from the clamp to leave screen. So we're done. We're going to go down to done new config. Safely power off the instrument. So that was a quick overview on how to make uh, high throughput measurements with your LA 600. If you have any more questions or need more information, you can go to our website or contact us directly or one of our distributors.